Hey guys, welcome back. Oliver here from Smiley Reacts. Here's right to the next episode of Chunkaka Over the Moon for you. This is the last episode of uh, this season. And in fact, it's been announced for an OVA next year and I believe a second season. So that's good news. Uh, but anyway, we're up to episode 12, Husband and Wife. Last episode was a really great episode. A uh, bit of a nostalgia trip for me as well because they were playing uh, Street Fighter. Both uh, Street Fighter V and the original Street Fighter. I'm just a bit surprised they didn't use Street Fighter II uh, because that's the of all of them so far, besides perhaps five. Two is the mo I believe the most popular of them because after all, Street Fighter II had like several different uh, versions of it. Uh, so yeah, a bit surprised they didn't do Street Fighter II. But I digress. Let us jump into this episode in a uh, three. Two, one. I'm going to miss this, listening to this theme. Well, until the OVA plays next, uh, airs next year, anyway. It's been a fun ride, that's for sure. I already mentioned that I really like this OP. <laughs> to the point where I now have it on Spotify. My plays my anime OP playlist on Spotify. <laughs> so think that's the last episode, I'm kind of surprised that they went with an OP. Because, you know, some episodes at the end of the season, they uh, don't play the OP. This one did. I want to record him. Since so they're talking about the system. Wow, he writes quickly. <laughs> Not that sort of break. <laughs> he moves very quickly. I, nobody can move that quickly. Hmm. Well, he overworked, so it looks like he's got a cold of some sort. He's definitely got a cold. Yeah, but you're coughing, which means he got a cold. All right. Yeah, that's definitely... I don't think you need to go to a hospital for that. I guess to get a uh, medicine, but you can get that. I guess maybe in Japan, they don't have pharmacies. But then you go to a hospital to get the, uh, the medicine. Anyway, I don't know. I need to look into that now. <laughs> oh, this should be good.
She doesn't get hurt or sick, yeah. Hmm. Well, well, that explains why she, uh, he's fast asleep. <laughs> Apples, you know, cut up like that. That's that's cute. <laughs> Perfect time to take photos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you can't do your back though. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is a normal trope of a uh, anime when people when a character gets sick, the uh, wiped down by another character. <laughs> uh, she's yeah obviously she's blushing too <laughs> Cute newlywed wife, yep. <laughs> I wonder how many times she's going to say that now. <laughs> that picture it, yep. <laughs> Bright red. But oh, that's still very cute. <laughs> she's got you there. <laughs> oh, it's an apple, so yeah, I'm assuming it's going to be good because if, unless it's, you know, uh, going brown, but yeah. Yeah, I can probably, I can definitely picture that. He just did not react at all. Yeah, and he did that too. <laughs> you can die sometimes. Sometimes you can die. That's a weird way of putting it. She's cute with the uh, buns up like that. We've seen her with the buns up before, but still, she's still cute where, like that.
Aww, <laughs> that's doubly cute. <laughs> that's first time. Oh, the oh, okay. Because I didn't remember them bringing it up before until now. But I guess there were flyers in previous episodes. I can't really remember. Aw. Oh, knew that were, yeah. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> About slowing down, yeah. Yeah, you got it mad now. <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> yes, you're not used to it, are you? <laughs> your parents, if you live with them and you're sick, just a thought. I'm pretty sure your parents would worry about you. Yeah, if you're going to summer, if, yeah, if, if you're going to any festival, you should wear a Utica. That's super hot. <laughs> the scientific basis for it? There's a scientific basis? <laughs> yeah, she's got uh, Saskia's back. Yeah, Kanami has got her back. Yes, you have, actually. <laughs> but she told you not to look anyway. She would get mad. He is such What is with this music? <laughs> you're staring pretty. Yeah, you're now staring. <laughs> yeah, you can't miss the fireworks at a festival. That's a very bad idea. Can lead to, um, well, isn't there like a superstition or something that if you miss your miss the New Year fireworks or any type of fireworks, um, or uh, it's like bad luck or something? Or am I just making that up? <laughs> he is being very frisky this episode, though. <laughs> I have taken photos of fireworks before. Yeah, it is very hard to take photos.
<laughs> He's like a child that's like got in a toy for the first time. <laughs> Of course. They always get Takayaki in this in these shows. <laughs> Weren't they still fried though? <laughs> oh, it's gonna be hot <laughs> because it's just well, it's just recently cooked. Goldfish. Yeah, I saw an Yeah, why? You're an interesting mix to have at a stall. Yeah, why are you here? Are, they, are you considered friends now? Yeah. When did that happen? <laughs> oh, like uh, with the uh, Street Fighter? Yeah, how about you, NASA, you try catching some goldfish. Don't get them fishies. <laughs> Is he going to be able to catch anything? <laughs> Damn. That's what he blushes at. <laughs> That's probably a good idea if it's, again, meant to be a... I don't even know what this festival is about. Is it like a new, the New Year festival? I think it did say on the flyer, but I kind of missed it. Stability throughout the universe? <laughs> Those are very big wishes. And his net from falling apart. Hmm. What, eating ramen three day three times a day for like breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I guess it ramen is pretty heavy, pretty heavy uh food to eat. So yeah.
<laughs> oh, thanks for interrupting, but I guess they were kissing earlier on. Yeah, I don't think any of them are buying it, except for maybe Aya. No, we're not all here. We're missing the younger sister. That's not small, yeah. That's quite a lot of pictures. <laughs> <laughs> She's he's got you there again. Oh, yeah, there's the fireworks. Oh, there's the other one. I didn't see her earlier. Okay, and this is how the episode's going to end, with them looking at the fireworks, right? Oh, I can't, I can't help but say that over and over again that the all thing because it really is really adorable their relationship. And that's the end of oh, and that is the end of the episode and the end of the season. What a good way to end it. With them watching the fireworks together with everyone. So everyone that lives in, you know, in their area that they know. Well, all the main ones. <laughs> I really enjoyed this, honestly. It was a lot, it was different from what I was expecting because going into this, I only, I only had been told that like, oh, they make references to like other things and that's about it. But this surprised me. Like it wasn't just, oh, references everywhere. It was like a genuine, honestly, like love story, which I always enjoy so this was definitely a fun time to to watch and i hope i hope you guys enjoyed uh my uh reaction to uh the this uh series and it, since it should be coming back next year i hope you will enjoy well, if it is a second season that's been announced. Because I know there's an OVA, but I'm pretty sure a second season has been announced. I will be back for that. Um, so please, if you please let me know your uh, thoughts of this series in the comment section below. And I will see you soon for some more reactions, guys. As I said, I had a blast with this show, but I'm and I'm looking forward to seeing the OVA next year. So bye guys. <laughs>